Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today guys, we're working on Chevy Equinox, uh, which is pretty much the same thing as Pontiac Torrent, and we'll show you how to remove and replace front door speaker. Okay, if yours is not working or you want to upgrade, we'll show you how to remove and replace that one there. Stay with us guys, we'll demonstrate how to do it now. Please subscribe, let's grow that channel together. So what we need to do next with a Phillips screwdriver, okay right there there is a uh, screw that we need to remove, sometimes there is a cap on those, so all you have to do is just pry it out, okay and now we will need to pull that thing out, okay you need to open it, so if you start on this side it will be a little bit easier, Okay, there is a thing that you need to press in, right there. Okay, and after that you need to open the handle and, okay, slide it out. Okay, like that. Okay, next we need to get a prime tool and we will need to remove that center piece right here, that trim. And this one you have to be careful. You need to start it on this side and it will slide towards the back a little bit. It's tricky and you have to be very careful because uh, otherwise you might damage the clips. It's hard just to start it. Once you start it, it goes pretty easy. Okay, so we're gonna start it from the bottom side so that way we don't damage it, okay? And you need to start pulling this way and then towards the back. Just be careful not to break it. Those tend to break sometimes. Okay, so you have to help it a little bit. Okay, for the clips, do not just pull on the plastic and you need to pull towards the back now. Okay, the piece is out of there now. So next guys, there is two nuts right here. One right here, both or nuts, one there. With a 10 millimeter socket. Let's go ahead and remove those now. Sometimes it's hard to pull them out. Screws, that's what they are. Not even bolts. Okay, pretty long ones. So just with a 10 millimeter socket. Next with a uh, plastic prank tool, we'll need to remove that cap for the mirror there. And uh, you can actually go ahead and disconnect the wire if you need to. So uh, that's for the speaker, tweeter there, I think it's tweeter. And uh, get it out of the way so it's not hanging on the wires. And now on the bottom there is a, there is a place where you can pry it. Okay, you see right there. Okay, screwdriver worked a little bit better and if you get your fingers or a prank tool under the door panel, okay, you can start pulling, it comes this way really tight, to be honest with you, the clips are very tight. Once we remove it, we'll show you where exactly all the clips are located so you know what to expect, guys. Okay, a few there. Okay, now we need to go up just a little bit. Okay, and pull it out. Okay, you can see those are the clips right here on top that we have. Okay, so, so far, that's from the back side now. Check it out now. On top we have one, two, three, four clips. Then you have on the side. Okay, one we washed on the bottom. So we just slide this one in. Okay, and you can see all of them. That way you know where to apply more pressure. One of them came out and this one is even pink, which means it was replaced in the past as well with another one. So we're gonna pull it out and install it on the door panel right there that we're missing. Okay, right there now. Okay guys, once you remove the door panel, this is the speaker. Super easy to access. You need a 7 mm socket or a, I think uh, one, one quarter of an inch will do it to you. Okay, and we need to remove three screws now. Okay, you can see they're like forming triangular shape. Okay, and this one is supposed to have the Pioneer system, which is a little bit better than the, the cheap version, but I don't think it's much, much better. Okay, and all we have to do here, okay, you need to squish in that piece there, okay, and pull it out. Okay, you can see right here. And this one, this one is stuck pretty bad. Okay, so when you squish this one in, okay, you pull it out. 
Okay, this is the part on top. Okay, right there. You pull like that and you pull it out. And this, guys, is the front door speaker. That's how you remove it if you need to replace it, guys. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and let's grow that channel together.